They said I couldn't do it, that I'd never do it That I'd never make it to the end before I blew it But I took the energy, it got me through it Yeah, they got me through it, now I'm out here What's up everybody, this is Caleb And Jay And welcome to podcast Week 6, right? Yeah, I think it was week 6 Hell yeah <laughs> I'm never gonna I'm never gonna not ask what week it is It's like I'm always <laughs> right But like I'm never right, you know Um yeah. So we're going to switch up a little bit. Um, I want the intro to be currently like a, it's going to, we're going to introduce what we're doing for the week. So what what do you have for me? I, I know Monday we're going to be releasing this part will be part one of the podcast. Yes, And then sir. two and three will be Wednesday and Friday respectively. So what do you got Tuesday? So Tuesday we're going to be react or you're going to be reacting to hip hop lover by BTS. Our uh, critically acclaimed series, BTS Reactions. <laughs> yes. Um, I don't know this, how the song you, I don't know what we're doing, but we're doing it, you know? The song that you begged to react to. As All soon right. As you heard Someone about brought it. it up in the comments, and, <laughs> and I was like, you know what? Could be cool. So like, I guess begging, but like. <laughs> yeah. No, um, but then Thursday. Actually, let's go to Wednesday because. We have a special release on Wednesday that is additional to the podcast. We are doing a song review or song reaction to one of my new songs from the album, my album coming out Friday. Um, I haven't decided yet. I think it's going to be... Um, Actually, I'll keep it a secret. Watch, <laughs> watch on Wednesday, and uh, you'll see. It's gonna, it's gonna be a great song, and uh, you guys are gonna love it. Hopefully, or I'll cry. But like, <laughs> I think it'll be good. And then Thursday, I'm gonna have. We're gonna continue the Eminem like side of the reaction stuff, turning you into a stan, and mm -hmm. uh, um, we're gonna listen to "Guilty Conscience" by Eminem. His okay second well third track on his first album but second song overall and uh okay really gonna introduce you to the storytelling side of eminem it's gonna be really good man i'm just yawning for some reason <laughs> you're tired as a bitch dude yeah man that's why i have my not a sponsor <sighs> you're not a sponsor <laughs> my lord yeah, I just got some water here. You gotta start drinking coffee or something on these mornings, dude. <laughs> I probably should, but I don't usually drink coffee. Yeah, yeah. Coffee. One of the ones that I'm one of the ones that doesn't drink coffee all that often. Let me move my notes up a little bit. If I'm looking <laughs> up, it's because I'm reading. <laughs> <laughs> um but yeah dude um we're actually we have to record a lot more than just what we talked about because i'm not going to be here next weekend so we have to make up for lost time which kind of sucks but yeah you told me about that but you didn't tell me where you were going so i don't know yet for sure so <laughs> it's gonna be i'm going out east with a friend east of uh east. the u.s if you will but uh <laughs> Originally, it was going to be somewhere in West Virginia, but we don't know if those plans are going to happen. So we're shooting for maybe Tennessee and doing uh, like getting like a and b on the lake or something like that. Gotcha. It's going to be cool. It's not bad. It's gonna... Yeah, hopefully. He wants to do like a lot of cliff jumping and uh, I want to travel. <laughs> so hmm. th that's my entire plan. He's going to do the cliff jumping, and you're going to be doing the driving. Um, No, nah, I don't want to drive, dude. I'm going to make him do all the driving. It's his <laughs> trip. I was just invited, dude, so I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Fair enough. No, but I have a really cool plan um, for it. I, I ordered a bunch of like um, business cards and stickers oh, God. Um, that, have, that have my album art with a QR code that links to my, like all of my artist profiles, like Spotify and Apple music and every like YouTube, SoundCloud, all that. Um, my plan is on this trip, everywhere we stop, I want to drop off like a good stack of cards. And then like, I'm not going to say the next part, but, um, leave stickers places. Um, 
don't trace back to me. Um, <laughs> yeah, but it'll be cool. Like, I haven't really done any marketing besides like, like some like running sponsors on Instagram and Facebook and stuff. Mm-hmm. So it'll be cool to market outside of Texas and see how that works for me. Cause like I believe in my music, but uh, I need other people to listen to it to believe in it too. Mm-hmm. And that just doesn't happen on social media because no one wants to sit there and be like, scroll through Twitter and be like, oh, look, he posted about the album again. Or I could just read 50 more Twitter posts and then keep going. Like, <laughs> I don't know. But yeah, where, uh, what are you planning on doing this summer? Uh, I- I'm mainly going to be working a lot on my music. Um, I don't know about traveling. Maybe pop to the beach if I can. Yeah. Well, depends on if they open them or not, or stop attacking people with as cops. Because <laughs> I've been hearing about all the stuff about uh, people getting pulled over or just straight arrested at beaches. Oh, really? Which, yeah. There's there's a lot of stuff going on with that. I think it's finally calmed down, but like towards the beginning and stuff, it was just nasty. Interesting. Well, I know now. Um. At least in Texas, most things are opening back up, so it might not be an issue whenever you're deciding to go. Yeah, it shouldn't be. I've had a couple friends go, and they didn't have any issues. I think it was just you got to keep your space, and that's it. Yeah, for sure. I don't like the beach <laughs> too much. I enjoy the beach. It's fun. Like, it's... Uh, my my issue with it is, like, I hate being just, like, dirty, <laughs> But and like when you're just covered in sand, it's inescapable, and it's so fucking difficult. Especially when it's, you have to get back in your car and you're covered in sand. Now your car is, has sand all inside of it, dude. It's a big mess. And also, dude, Texas that, beaches just suck. Like, unless you go way far down the coast, it's yeah, rough. you have to go south yeah. for sure. Yeah, like uh, I think it's South Padre or something like that. It has some really good beaches, from what I've heard. South Padre. My friend said Port A has good beaches, but there's really nothing around them to do. So, oh, <laughs> which is it's it's weird. I feel like if you had a nice beach, you would build infrastructure around it and like have shops and restaurants and hotels and stuff like that. But Texas is like, no, we'll do that in Galveston, where the nicest beaches are, according to that one picture that keeps circling around on Facebook. <laughs> I don't know if you've seen that one where it's just like, oh my god, I miss Galveston so much, and it's just like blue, crystal clear waters and like a beach, and like they're dead serious. Like it doesn't make any sense to me. I'm like, I've been to Galveston numerous times, not it. Bolivar is just remotely better, but still not blue, not even close. Like I love going to Bolivar Peninsula. That's a good, that's a decent place to go to, but it's not clean. Is that the Not one that's connected to Surfside, or is that a dif- uh, different direction? Uh, you have to take the ferry to go from Galveston to it. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, That's cool. Yeah, the... Um, uh, Crystal Beach, I think, is the name of the beach. That's right, actually, yeah. Damn, I haven't been down there in a while, even before <laughs> stay-at-home orders. Like... I was I, there I just right before. <laughs> I was there literally days before a lot of that stuff started to happen. Yeah, didn't y'all do a bonfire? Yeah, we got a bonfire going. We we took some. We took a whole bunch of like specific stuff just to get a bonfire going because we've had issues with getting them going before. Yeah, that's pretty cool. So, see that fun. kind of stuff. That kind of stuff would be fun if it was just like a big group of friends. And not just like family and like another friend or like just two friends. I don't know. <laughs> I feel like I feel like honestly, I feel like the more people that are at a beach, the more fun it is. Yeah, that's a hot take. I usually take a whole truck full at least, unless you're alone, because then you can do literally anything and not have to worry <laughs> about other people stopping you. True. So <laughs> that's why it's, we go it's kind so of like far a, out. It's like a bell curve. Well, inverse bell, a U curve. Damn, it's fun with less and then fun with more. <laughs> I'd say like five is the median where it's like not fun at all. <laughs> five can be fun. Depends on the five. 
True. Yeah, I guess so. Oh, so we need to add more statistics into this graph, dude. We got to be like, are they fun people? Or are they not fun yeah, people? Yeah, it, it's a three D. It's a three D graph. Oh God. <laughs> I didn't go to school for this. I didn't go to school at all. Well, I did, but not <laughs> I for, didn't this. Go to school for this. Yeah, no, not for this. <laughs> um, speaking of like beaches, like the fucking, I I keep seeing this video from, I guess California, where like the water is glowing, and like the sand's glowing and stuff. The I hell? don't know if it's like After Effects on the video or what, <laughs> but Maybe. it looks cool. It's like. I, supposedly it's like bioluminescent like plankton and uh supposedly and it just lights up the water and it looks really cool like i'll have to take a look i haven't seen that before actually i haven't seen the picture i'll, I'll see if i can find it and send it to you but it looks really cool like if that was just everywhere i would be way ecstatic. more down like, for <laughs> i'm going to the yeah. beach every day yeah i'll live on a beach dude <laughs> <laughs> Have one of those stilt houses. Oh, that'd be cool. I just want like I want access to the beach directly, dude. A nice little it, trail. It is uh, quite fun. I remember when we were on a vacation and we were just at a hotel next to the beach and it was really fun. You could just literally get to the bottom floor, walk out the back. There's a pool area and then the beach. Like a like a resort type thing, yeah. It was, no, it was quite literally. It was Daytona Beach, so it was really fun. Nice. Um, that's it was really a cool. like a whole resort type of deal. That's really nice. Yeah, I want to go to Florida again. It's I mean, there's a lot of crazy shit that happens there, but like, <laughs> I want to go. It's been a while since I've been, and their beaches are nice, and like, there's it's so lively. I think is the, the yeah part of it that I like. Like, I don't know. Sometimes you just go to the beach, and there's just people sitting doing nothing <laughs> like like okay like there's water you could swim in mm-hmm. you could we went like, for a spring break and it was just absolutely just flooded with people and that's and that's what i like i like when places are fucking popping off like that it's the best <laughs> oh but no um so i did want to take like part of this to talk about the my album a little bit all right. But, like, I I don't know what to say besides, like, I'm super excited that it's coming out. And, like, I've been super stressed the past two months working on it. And I think I'm actually at the point now where I'm, like, de-stressing finally. Like, it's, it's all coming out of me. I, I was watching fucking TV yesterday, and I was just sitting there, and I was like... I could cry right now because I'm, like, not stressed anymore. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, wow, that was a super sad thought. Um, but, yeah. No, dude. I don't know. I'm excited for it. You haven't really heard much from it, have you? I've heard literally nothing from it. Besides, there are, there's two songs on there that I've released already. But I didn't even listen to those. <laughs> I hate you. <laughs> 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 no, that's funny. Um, <laughs> yeah, dude, there's it's gonna be good. It's releasing on iTunes, Apple Music, Spotify. The standard. Yeah, the standard. Everything. I, I hope people hope people like catch on to it. You know, because mm-hmm. it's it's probably my best work. Like I've I put a lot of fucking time into this shit, dude. And uh, I think it shows. I think it really does. Yeah, I've been noticing that you've just been, like, not gaming anywhere near as much as you usually usually do. So you've definitely been working on it. Yeah, like, so I say I've I've worked on it for two months, right? But, like, within that time, there was a week in April. Yeah, a week in April that I literally worked, like, my job. I, and I think I talked about it a little bit before. I worked my job, and then I immediately went to the music and worked like eight hours on the music, music, and mm-hmm. then fell asleep. Started over the next day. Um, that was that was something else, dude. That was I was dead after that one. No, I remember two jobs myself. It's not the most uh, sustaining. No, not at all. The right it's, word. Yeah, like. Even- 
even if one is actually like enjoyable to do or passionate to do, it's still exhausting. Yeah. Yeah. I just, so. I, I don't, I try to think back on like how, like everything that happened during that week. And I don't remember much of anything. <laughs> that's how, that's how locked in I was. I don't even think I saw my friends like for four days in a row. <laughs> and I you live just, with three of them. Like, <laughs> it was like bad. snuck down in the middle of the night, grab food, ran back. Basically, yeah, I would like I'd wake up, eat a little bit, um, work, and then ten ten eleven o'clock I would stop working and eat something, fall asleep, and then start over. And that's like I was lucky if I ate actually because I was. That's I was bad, dude. I didn't eat much actually. <laughs> I think I lost like five pounds that week. <laughs> Yeesh. Yeah, no, it's not good. But then this week, uh, this past week, I kind of did the same. Not as diff, not as hard, but um, I definitely took. I think I took half the week in the previous week to do all that again. Um, but I finished. I finished everything. I have the album. I have the second part of the album that's not releasing in stores. It's going to release on like just YouTube and SoundCloud um, because it's all like remixes, mm-hmm. um, which that'll be cool. I'm excited for that. It's like it's a sequel to my first like mixtape that I dropped in like 2017. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, it'll be cool. But. I'm I'm trying to figure out how to live life again <laughs> as a normal person. <laughs> like I'm going to have a lot of free time now for a little bit until I like start working on music again. Mhm. But I don't know. I don't know how to survive. Been playing a lot of Minecraft so far. <laughs> <laughs> That's about it. Me and my friends are trying to go to the moon like <laughs> Yeah, I've been I had to mute your channel because there was just so much talking on it from that. Yeah. Like, just non-stop. Well, yeah, we have... We post a lot of stuff because we're trying to, like... Trying to get each other, like, resources to figure out how to work things and, like... Well, yeah, I, I'm not saying like, as a... There's, like, six people in the channel at a given time. Like, <laughs> it's bad. Yeah. I'm not saying it was a bad thing, just saying it was a lot. So I was like, okay, let me just uh, turn that down. Yeah. <laughs> I don't blame you. I would mute my I'll, channel too if I could. <laughs> <laughs> so I was just sitting there like, why is Discord continuously telling me that there's a new mention? And I'm like, I don't see it. It yep. must be that chat. Okay. Yep. It is. <laughs> yeah. But it's cool though. We got to the moon. We built a teleporter. I'm still farming. I don't know if you know about that. But <laughs> all my, Everyone's like working on going to the moon and I set up a mystical like agriculture farm. Oh. I'm just I'm just doing that only because like I've been to the moon before. <laughs> Don't tell them, but like, so I was like, <laughs> yeah, yeah, you guys can go. I'll just work on this because it's a cool it's a cool mod pack or mod. Mm-hmm. So, uh, but yeah, I'm ready to play like Call of Duty again. More, I I started getting really bad at it because I haven't like actually played it played it in a while. And so, like, every time I go back to it, it's, like, fucking, like, reinventing the wheel, dude. It's bad. <laughs> I feel like trash. I feel like I was tw- I was 12 years old again, and I was screaming at kids on Xbox Live, dude. <laughs> oh, my lord. You see 20-year-olds doing that nowadays. Well, that's for YouTube. You have to make your content somehow. And if you're not screaming, it's not funny. <laughs> Not wrong. I hate those type of fucking gamers, dude. <laughs> it's so annoying. Literally every single day. Ah, oh my god, he's killing me. He's killing me. Like, shut up. Just play the game. <laughs> Looking at oh, you, PewDiePie. Lord. Oh. <laughs> Shots fired. No, nah, he doesn't do that anymore. He used to. I used to not like his content because he did that a lot. And I was like, I don't. It's not the type of energy I want to listen to every day. But now he just makes <laughs> funny videos, so I'm cool. <laughs> People are gonna hunter. fuck. Achievement hunter screams, but like not like that. They, no, they get, they like get loud, but they're not screaming and yelling and. Oh God! Oh God! Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, 
No, it's just you have him just screeching out of nowhere when he gets like jump scared yeah. in a video game that well, has no jump scares. Thing. Yeah, that's the thing too. It's like it's usually genuine reaction, right? So it's like you can tell the difference <laughs> between genuine and forced. Like, I don't know, but maybe that's why our gaming channel didn't do well. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't for- we didn't force the screams enough. But we were also playing Stardew Valley. All right, dude, chill out. That's the best game that's <laughs> ever been made, dude. So there's not much to react to on that one. We the, fought monsters in a dungeon, dude. There's that's like, like that's, you know, like that's a lot. Not for someone that does <laughs> that on the daily. To be I fair, did. I didn't realize you were a minor. <laughs> that there's a joke in there somewhere. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, there is. No, I, um, I I play the dungeon crawling games like all the time, so that's nothing new to me, at all. So. That's why I dominated that uh, that competition. All right, shut up. How about that? <laughs> How about you don't talk to me and my child ever again? <laughs> oh, yeah. my Lord. I don't know. I really like that game. I think there's there's a way to make a video in, in that game, but I don't think we figured it out. <laughs> no, like, we at all. not. Not even a little bit. It was fun, though. We had a good time. The editing wasn't too horrible. No, that it actually took a bad. while. It took because we were switching between two uh, point of views like constantly, so you had to like yeah. watch both of them and like pick the switches and everything. Yeah, and that's really annoying. Definitely took a while, but oh yeah, not too bad. Um, what was he gonna talk about? I, that wasn't a full sentence. I'm, uh, god damn. Um, oh, we were gonna talk about Avatar. <laughs> Yeah, Avatar coming it's to Netflix. Fucking, it's on Netflix now, and my heart is full, dude. That's one of the best cartoons ever made. Oh, 100%. That's one of the best like, ones. I own, I still own the DVDs of it. I never, we, we've we never owned the DVDs, so it's been years since I've seen any of it. And it's made me very <sighs> you're sad. In for, you're in for a treat when you watch it again, dude. It holds up so well. Like, oh, I'm, I'm excited. So it came out yesterday as of this recording friday the 15th of may um 2020 Mm -hmm. (laughs) so it came out and then i started working and i was like it's time i watched 16 episodes of it (laughs) (laughs) is that how you got like no sleep last night no well i played minecraft till 3 a.m last night but I don't. I lost all my good shit, dude. It got disapparated in a teleporter. But we're off that Ugh. topic. So anyway, I watched 16 episodes, and like it starts off like a little bit slow, but it picks up really fast. And like there's so much stuff happens in the first season that you don't realize was like there. You're like, oh, I thought this episode was like 20 episodes later, and it's like you think that for each episode, which is weird. So. Mm-hmm. But it holds up, like, the pacing's really good, like, the, the voice acting and the animation and stuff. It's really good, dude. And the story, obviously, is just A tier. Like, one of the best cartoons. Mm-hmm. 100%. Yeah. If you, uh, if you were in that world, what power do you think you would have? Like, what bending? Hmm... I'd love to have air bending, but I think I'd probably just like get earth bending or something like that. I was gonna say I think you would be a rock uh, earth bender. <laughs> I feel like I would be a water bender somehow. <laughs> I don't know. I feel like earth isn't my style, but I don't know. What what do you think for me? Hmm. I don't know. I'd probably shoot between water and like maybe fire. That was my thought, too. Yeah. Maybe. I think it leans heavy on the water, though. And I don't know why. Oh, I know why. It's because I spit in my wraps, bro. <laughs> I'm already a water bender. Jesus. I'm cutting that out of the video. <laughs> <laughs> my lord. What other cartoons are there that would be sick to watch again? I keep hitting my fucking microphone. Um, 
Yeah. <laughs> now you're hitting microphone, not your camera. <laughs> yeah. It's dude, I just I move around so much. It's not good. Um SpongeBob just, would be a fun one to watch again. SpongeBob would be a fun one to watch. That one's still live though, to be fair. No, we, yeah, we need, but we, we need to go for the ones stuff. that have been dead for a while. That's true. Like uh what's that? Code Code Lyoko? Did you ever watch that one? No. That one was a really weird one on cart I think it was Cartoon was it Cartoon Network? I have no clue, dude. I've never even heard I of that. I don't know. <laughs> I don't remember which one it was on, but Code Lyoka was a weird but pretty good one, honestly. Uh, what was was there? Samurai Jack was a good one. That's a good one, yeah. People love um, that show, actually. Oh, yeah. And the last season, just perfect. <laughs> I, need to, I need to rewatch that. Um, the last season finally tied up all the storylines. I think Fairly Odd Parents would be a good one. That would be a good one. I think they're still technically live too, but it's different now. Yeah, Nothing was they, keep the adding, same. they kept adding new things, including a baby and everything like that. It was like, okay, this is getting weird. Well, the baby episodes were good. I think it, when they added yeah. a second kid, I think was kind of when it changed. Wait, they added a second kid? I didn't yeah, isn't, know there like about a, that. isn't there like a girl now that's with Timmy? I have no clue. Well, I guess I, I guess I don't know either. So, <laughs> <laughs> but no, every episode of Avatar so far has made me just like it makes me feel happy inside, dude. Like it brings mm-hmm. me back to simpler times, before the rap game, before the YouTube game, before working every day of my life. Um, damn. I'm not excited. I know there's a part, um, like halfway through the Earth series, or Earth season, that's um, like it's like artistic as fuck. Like it's like the store, like all the characters get separated in the Earth Kingdom, and there's like the each... desert. No, not the desert. There's like within okay. the Earth, like Bossing Say, I think, is the capital. Oh uh, yeah. And like they do like I'm an right. episode per character, and it's like this is all filler, but like. I don't know. I remember watching that as a kid and like, this is boring. <laughs> Off topic, but then, I hope that call I did, from my dad wasn't important. Oh, shit. Uh, well, honestly, we do need to kind of wrap up because we have to, like I said, I'm going to be out of town next weekend, so we have to be recording a few more things. Mm-hmm. Um, so we might record another podcast today, but I don't know No, I think we can do that. do that. I don't know. Maybe we'll just try to do it before you leave or something. I don't know. Yeah, we could do it during the week, maybe. Probably more maybe. shit going to happen. Um, my hair looks like shit under my hat. Um, <laughs> yeah, so we have we have the podcast coming out Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Tuesday will be Hip Hop Lover BTS Reaction. Uh, Wednesday will be a new song from yours truly, Reaction. Um, and, and then Guilty, Guilty Conscience, Conscience from Eminem. Yeah. Yep. Cool. And then we have blogs all day, every day, except for Sunday during the week. Which, oh, I don't know. Yeah. I said so many different qualifiers for that. Um, <laughs> every day except for Sunday, we have a blog on our website. So indexentertainment.com. Um, yep. Obviously shortened entertainment because we're not typing in the entire thing because we're lazy. So you should know and that by not, now. And we're not good writers. <laughs> well, I mean, I'm okay, but. <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, I'm just kidding. Fucking Is that it? I think that's it. I'm I'm that's it. about done for this. <laughs> yeah, we have so much to do. So, uh yeah, we'll see you guys next time. Thanks Bye-bye. for watching. They said I couldn't do it that I never do it that I never make it to the end before I blew it, but I took the energy it got me through it.